These images show a very large avidly enhancing mass expanding the cella and extending into the supracellar cistern, resulting in severe mass effect on the optic apparatus and third ventricle. The mass also extends posteriorly splaying the midbrain. Centrally in the supracellar mass, there is T1 hyperintensity and increased susceptibility compatible with hemorrhage. There is evidence of invasion into the cavernous sinuses with tumor encasing the cavernous and supraclinoid internal carotid arteries without narrowing them. There is also mass effect of the anteromedial right temporal lobe, secondary to marked tumor expansion of the right cavernous sinus. These findings are compatible with the giant pituitary macroadenoma with internal hemorrhage, which was confirmed on pathology. Differential considerations at the time of imaging include papillary subtype craniopharyngioma and a mass arising from the clivus or sphenoid sinus, which were considered much less likely in this case. This patient undoubtedly presented with visual changes. Peak incidence is in young adults ages 20 to 40 years old.